Howdy folks, hope you're all having a good weekend, and welcome back to The Beast Inside. Yes, it's time for me to, once again, inflict my weekly dose of torture upon myself so you lot can get some kind of sadistic kick out of it. Well, whatever pays the bills, I suppose. Right, made it to the third floor of the inn. Windows are locked. What the hell is that painting? That is some seriously messed up shit. It looks like there's only one way to go. Huh. Looks like the drawers have formed a natural staircase. Search George's office. New objective. Who's George again? Is that a floor plan? Well, that doesn't exactly help. Not seeing any... Oh, hang on. Yeah, more really messed up paintings. What's that noise? Stop that. There's some kind of... Oh, there we go. This must be George's office. Don't have the key. Have to pick the lock. Come on. Oh, yeah. Gently does it. And we're in. Oh, do you really have to make so much noise? Nothing seems to immediately be trying to jump out and eat my face. Let's, uh, let's shut the door behind me. You never know. Maybe I'm just being optimistic. <laughs> but I might at least... If something's coming up behind me, I'll hear the door opening. Oh, oh, I thought that was a candle that I could light. There's a... Why is there a lit cat? Who's lighting these candles? It's not me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You were supposed to check every possibility, Norton. You're a judge, and you should know how to bend the law without breaking it. The contract states you can both hand over your shares without each other's consent. I'm sorry, George, but you signed it yourself. I never thought that bastard would try to outwit me, and that his demented spawn would sneak into the mine. What do you expect? The brat cannot inherit. We have to persuade that old fart somehow, or we'll end up with nothing. Did that really happen? Did they plot against my father and me? Oh, so that was Judge Norton my dad's business partner. Well, that would explain why my dad would want them both dead if they were plotting against him. And obviously Judge Norton was crooked. So what is it that I'm looking for in here? Nothing in the papers on the desk. Nope, everything here is locked. Windows locked, another freaky painting. Oh, the drawers are open. Nothing in that one. Uh, there's a paper in that one. Is that? Nope. Nope. Nothing important. Let's check the other drawers. Nope. Aha! Uh -huh. Bunch of keys. Reception. Yes. All I have to do is go back to the reception desk and find Gilman in the guest registry. Okay. So Gilman was the detective. I think he was here investigating the murder of the guy who was. Well, we saw his ghost lying on the floor of the lobby when we when we uh, arrived at the inn. Well, he wasn't actually dead, although he didn't have long left. They were saying, go and find the detective. I just don't know which was his room, which is why I need to go down to reception so I can find out what room he was in. And now I have the reception key. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's just... Lamp ran out. 
<laughs> it's okay. Everything's under control. Nothing to see here, folks. That's better. Stop making those noises. Stop it. Oh, some more kerosene? Yep, I'll have that. Don't want to run out. I'm beginning to see why this inn burned down. What's this? Judging by the description, Henry seems like a typical melancholic, but I wouldn't jump to conclusions and say that he must have committed suicide. Too many people have gone missing in three years. Uh, in these parts. Mr. Hyde, I've already written to you multiple times, but I've never received a reply, so I'm asking again. Do you really not remember my brother Henry? You stayed at your inn. Uh, so, somebody's brother disappeared while staying at this inn. Somebody who goes by the name of Henry. And my father has never answered any of the letters questioning the disappearance. Wait, my father owned this inn. I suppose he must have. Newspaper clipping. Uh, secret message somewhere. Wednesday, September 13th, 1854. Sheriff issued an arrest warrant for Jacob Hyde, a mine and inn owner. Hyde is accused of murdering Judge John Norton. So, Daddy was a murderer. Is there something in there? More kerosene. We'll take it. I mean, I knew he was a bit of a bastard. I guess it's not such a stretch. I mean, if his, you know, business partners were plotting against him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, fuck no. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Run away. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, God, no. Oh god, I hope I'm going the right direction. Oh, oh. I have no idea where I'm going. If I make a wrong turn, I'm dead. Can I? No, no, oh, through here. Yes, I know there are things there that I missed. I don't care. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Reception, reception, reception. And. Oh, oh my god, no. Fuck. This game's a bastard. Let me think I was safe and then jump out at me like that. Detective Steve. Ah. Uh, right. Oh, it's that famous painting of that Polish court jester again. Uh huh. The detective was staying in. Uh huh. There should be a spare key somewhere. Uh, room 202. Places. The key for room 203 is missing. But maybe. Maybe I can get there from room 202. I must find out how much Gilman knew. Oh, windows open. Actually, um, if I have to go upstairs, I'd rather go that way than go back out into reception. Quick look. Oh, there's something in there. Maybe I have the key for that room now. Oh, it's worth a look. Let's just top up the lantern. It's starting to run low. Alright, let's... Because there was a locked door at the end of the corridor after reception. And there's something in there, something useful. So, oh, more kerosene. Just make sure there's nothing else in here. More matches. Right, let's go see. Oh. Well, so much for that idea. Right, I guess we are going this way after all. Well, that's one way of getting up to the second floor. Right, 
don't anything jump at that window while I'm walking past here. Don't you fucking do it. No, we're good. We can't get through there. Jump. Made it. And a suspiciously convenient open window. Okay. More seriously messed up pictures. Uh, that noise is really getting on my tits. I'm going to shut the window. There. So there's a hole in the wall, but it's blocked by a cupboard that I can't move. Maybe from the other side. What was that? What? Who's you? Oh. Door locked? Doesn't matter, there's a hole in the wall right next to it. It is locked. Yeah. Guess we're going through the hole in the wall. Not going that way. Oh, there's 203. Quickly, I need to hide. What the hell is that? Can I go back? I get the distinct impression that if he sees me, it's it's not going to be good. Right, let's go, let's go. Quietly, quietly, quietly. Oh, shit, nope. I'm going this way whether I like it or not. Um, all right. Gonna have to time this. Oh, no, I'm gonna have to time it better than that. Uh, yeah, this isn't the time, Nicholas. This really isn't. Ow! Shit! Okay, run, 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 run. Yes. Oh, I've got the key. This must be 202. Shut the door. Shut the door! Oh, I can block it with. Oh, oh, bollocks. No, 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 God. Alright, so that didn't. That didn't really work as planned. Let's try again. The thing is, he, he doesn't... I mean, yeah, right, he walks from one end of the corridor to the other, but he doesn't stay on the other end, around the corner, long enough. In 202, I can easily get to the next room. I need to know how much he's found out. He stays there for what? Five or six seconds? That's not enough time for me to get past without him seeing me. Well, it might be enough time for me to get past without him seeing me, but it definitely won't be enough time for me to get past without him hearing me if I run. Hey, he saw me. <laughs> Come on. Shut the door, shut the door. Block it, block it, block it. Alright. How long is that going to hold him? He's got a crowbar, after all. And it's not exactly a reinforced wooden... Oh, shit. Yeah, that's not going to hold him for long. Okay. Um, how the hell do I get into the next room from here? W ah, window, window, window. Maybe he won't know I went there. So, oh, shit, I thought I'd fallen to my death. <laughs> okay. We're in the detective's room. I'm not hearing any sounds of pursuit. More stuff. Oh, I'm not liking the sound of this music. Oh, Gilman! Oh, this Open again. Open the door. We need to talk, just you and me. Greetings, Mr. Hyde. Cut the pleasantries. I know what you're up to. I don't really know why you're so upset. I really. You aren't the only hack who thought he could sniff out a scoop. But I'm not looking for a scoop. I just want to sort this out. There's something unsettling going on in this charming little corner of the world. So many people have gone missing, including your friend, Judge John Norton. I want to find him. Please. That's my sole motivation. You can shove him up your ass! 
You want to prove I'm responsible for his vanishing, because you're just desperately looking for a story that will get you publicity. The word publicity sounds strange, coming from someone specializing in sweeping things under the rug. Two years have passed since the incident in the mine, and many things still remain unclear. People lost their lives. Many others have gone missing since. And you act like it was just a minor incident. It was an accident. A tragic accident that cost the lives of my employees and ruined my business. That's all. Oh, I'm afraid that's not all. Ever since then, people have gone missing in the area. Many people, even guests of this establishment. Enough! I want you out of my inn by tomorrow. You hear me? left something here well it looks like daddy dears was killing so many guests and I don't know why that eventually a detective turned up trying to figure out well at least what was going on behind one of the disappearances more kerosene unsurprisingly the detective never checked out another one of dad's victims What's this? During his investigation on the missing judge, the detective discovered that people have been disappearing for a long time in these parts ever since the explosion at the mine. The disappearances started right after the accident at the mine. I am aware that the neighbourhood isn't very safe with all the forests, mountains, swamps, caves and whatever, but I don't believe... Yeah, yeah, the detective... The detective went to the mine that day. ...isn't falling for it. Nobody knows if he ever came back. I must retrace his steps. There may still be traces of what happened back then. Oh, I've got to go in the mine. I vaguely remember the accident, but... Gunpowder barrels? Missing people? What's happened here? My father was a cruel man. I can't deny that. But would he be capable of killing in cold blood? Oh, hell yeah. I guess I'll have to go down into the mine. Great. That's just great. I know how you feel, Nicholas. Ah, yes. The cupboard opens from the other side. Well, it doesn't open, but you can move it from the other side. Oh, great. Now I can't get back out of the window. So... Oh, that door wasn't open earlier. Oh! Oh, we're on the other side of the blockage in the... What the fuck is this? What the hell? This is not going to be good, is it? I suspect I'm not going to like this much. must have lost my mind. That's the stairs down to reception. All I have to do is get out of the inn. I can't cut through them. Don't I have the shears anymore? I could cut through them earlier. Uh, same there. Oh, that's not good. That's not going to be good at all. Am I supposed to follow the trail of blood? Is it only in my head? down here? No. Doors sealed with more vines? No. Dead end. Why do we have to follow the trail of blood? I, 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 I don't want to. <laughs> Get out of the inn, they said. Oh yeah, that'll be easy. This music isn't helping. Is this... is this reception this way? Yes, yes it is, that's reception. I think I'm going mad. You think? Uh oh. What's happening? What's going on? Game, what are you doing? Oh! Fuck that noise. 
Yeah, we're running away. Shit. Shit, no, stuck on the chain. God damn it, come on, go, 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 shit, dead end. Dead. Where is he? Where did he go? Where? Oh, bollocks. I don't get it. Where am I supposed to? Oh, I can pick the lock. Oh, it's only two tumblers. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Faster, 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 faster. Come on, come on, come on. Got it, got it, got it. Come on, get the door. Oh! Bollocks. All right. Let's try that again. Okay. And run away. Ready to skip that. Plenty of time, plenty of time. He moves slowly. No need to rush. There's one. There's no. Come on. Come on. There's two. Come on. In your own time. Thank you. And we're out of the inn. Fuck. It's not enough. Ah! Yeah, that's not really going to hold him for long, is it, Nicholas? Oh god, he's through the gate. Why don't I even stop to take the time to... Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Come on, come on, come on. Oh shit, another one. Uh, oh, uh, uh, no, no. Okay. I don't get it. How was I supposed to avoid that? Oh, hang on a second. I think I know where I went wrong. When I ran into the shack, I should have turned left instead of right. I think. Well, I've got nothing else. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's what we're going to do. Okay. Alright. Into the shack, turn left, not right. Uh, no, this this one. There. No, no. Yeah, there, no, right, not left. Oh my god, it was the other way around. Oh, shit. Oh, no, okay. no. Alright, alright, just keep heading in the direction where there aren't leather faces trying to... Oh, bollocks, what's... I have to run. You think? You figured that one out by yourself, did you, Nicholas? Oh, grab on! Oh, I don't like the look of that. Run, run, run... No, don't get stuck. <laughs> Come on! Oh! Oh! No, no! I'll get there eventually. <laughs> I hope. Okay. So that time... Uh, I should have turned left instead of right. Okay. Left, not right, Jingles. Left, not right. Come on. Yeah, this is where the bridge collapses. I have to run. Well spotted, Nicholas. Grab and hold. Yes, it's starting to collapse. Turn and look. Shit your pants. Run away. <laughs> Up the stairs. Keep going. Left. That's it. Ah, uh, follow the lights, I suppose. This way. No, oh, dodge that. Dodge that. No, oh, bollocks. No! No, 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 no. Ah, no, 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 no. Wait, was this... Am I... Yes! No! This, that was it! That was it! That was it! That was it! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, I thought I fucked it up. And run into the really dark and foreboding train tunnel? And that was it! Oh! And we're going back to the present. <sighs> right, that's it. I I'm done. That's enough for one week. <laughs> I hope you lot are happy. 
I need to go and change my trousers and have a good long lie down. <laughs> I tell you what, during a global toilet paper shortage, this is not the kind of game I should be playing. Nevertheless, I hope you've enjoyed it, and I hope you're all having a, a safe and happy weekend. As always, folks, take care, and I'll catch you next time.